Asiko. Hey, hey. Asiko Sikle. Bunda, bunda. Ibu. Sasa Joy. Sasa Sikle. Ukapa. Ah. Okay. Now. <laughs> okay. So, guys, we we have come and we have some bad news. While we were away, this man died. This is Noah. Remember the guy who was being sexually abused by his son. Noah died. The, the this son actually finally killed him. We wanted to take him to the to the senior home. He said no. Yumba ilisha anguka mpaka mahindi ya mepano ya mekua kubwa. Eh. Ah, ili anguka wapi. And so, that is, that is the house we built for him. Now his son took over the house. After Noah died, he took over the house. My gosh. This house used to be here. Oh, that is the grave. Poor Noah. Sometimes people die and you, you feel like, uh, should I be sorry? Should I feel bad that it happened? And then you tell yourself, well, this is a self-inflicted blow. It is seriously a self-inflicted blow. So he now went and this guy is there in the house who built him. He couldn't even wait. He had his own little. Sasa uliangusha yako ukaenda kwa ya muze. We nawe unasumbua. Ujama anasumbua. Hmm? Hii. Sasa u. Hey. 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 He says the wood. This one belongs to. He's so happy. Sasa muze alienda ukafurai. Ulifurai wewe. Siwe shida imekuondokea. Eh? Oh my. Some people are cursed. Some people are seriously cursed. Okay. Sasa hata ungeulizaka watu wenye walijenga nyumba wakupea ruhusa ndio uingie. Ukaangusha ya mzee, ukaangusha yako na kwenda kwa yetu. I think Kamara saw him with the knife and na wewe tukikuwa hapo mara ya mwisho ulikuwa ulikuwa umeweka kisu kwa kwa nguo ulitaka kuni ati ati kuni kunidunga Si ungejaribu uone Si ungejaribu tuone mimi nikipiga wewe risasi mahali pabaya sana Nilikuwa na kisu Ulikuwa na kisu kwa mgongo huku 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 Mhm Hata saa hii nilikuwa nayo Saa hii umeweka kwa nyumba you know, this guy had a knife in his pocket. And when we were shooting the video, I didn't see it. <laughs> I didn't see the knife, but I was so ready for him. <laughs> I was so ready for him, <laughs> my gosh. Because, uh, you know, such people can, can really mess you up. So I was so ready for him. If he dared try to stab me, I would really have bitten the hell out of his ass. So that's a... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yes, if you could have tried it on me, man, you would have seen fire. So, uh, anyway, Noah died. I wanted Noah to go to the senior home. He said he cannot go. I wanted to take this guy to the police. He said, my son is innocent. I think somebody 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 explained to me what that thing means. It's it's a psychological thing where you you love people who molest you. I have a friend, Tarikson. Tarikson explained the the psychological condition uh, where you just want to associate with people who and I went and researched about it. I don't know how why I forgot. You know, I'm on medication, and this medication has taken away a lot of my memory. 
I can't remember so many things. And so I think Noah suffered from that. I'm told there was a guy in the UK who abducted this girl. And this little girl finally fell in love with this abductor and loved the man and didn't want to leave because they were in love. There is a name, I remember that and put it in the description. And if I can't, I have intelligent people in my audience and they will do that. So, Nani? Angana, uh, Anaitu Angana. Angana? Julius. Julius Angana? Julius? I want to ask him how he feels now that his father passed on. Hiyo ni nini karatasi ya ya kufanya nini? Mm. Hmm. Mm. Oh, a burial permit, death certificate, yeah. or certificate of death. Mm. Okay. Sasa unasikia aje sasa mzee ulipiga wapi? He says the, the, the disease was not was not sexual assault. It is it's written there. Ah, waliandika wapi? Ugonjwa yake waliandika wapi? Wameandika wapi ugonjwa? Hakuna ah, mahali wameandika ugonjwa. Mm -hmm. That is the ya ugonjwa at malaria. Hakuna. Walikuwa na mtibia. Hakuna at malaria. Wewe ndiye ulienda ukadanganya ati ati ni malaria. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> He's so happy. He, he actually killed the father. Oh my gosh. I, I'm feel, I feel sorry for some people. Yeah. Oh, look at that. He used to be such a, a handsome man before he was messed up. Oh, poor, poor Noah. When we met him, he was totally different from this. Sasa wakati alikufa, ulilia. I'm asking whether he, he, he cried when his father passed on. He said, ah, 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 I'm told he really cried. Sasa ulikuwa unalia nini? Sini kuzumbua tu wewe Julius. Awali nimebaki peke yangu. Madada zako alienda. Baada ya kufa. Mimi nimebaki peke yangu hivi. Sina mama, sina watoto wetu, sina baba. Na niko. Na bibi si upate. Niko nao wengi. Nitakule. Nakuleta mmoja kutoka kwa hii boma. Eh mimi najua sababu. Kwa hii boma najua sababu. Atakufa tena. Okay, so he says he has no father, he has no brother, no sister. Like in my sister, what is it? What? Oh, oh, even the sisters died. So the brothers died, the sisters died. Now his father died. So now he's alone. Well, you wanted to be alone. So we baba ko ukataka ko peke ako. Unajua mtu akisikisha 77 years hiyo saba ajuni bonus Mungu anampatia bonus Kwa hivyo babaka alikuwa ameshatosha kufa kitambo Yeah Si alikuwa amepitika 70 sasa hiyo saba ajuu ni bonus kutoka kwa Mwenyezi This father reached 70 he was he died when he was 77 so the 7 years were just bonus <laughs> so he should have died at 70 Eh. Aki ile bangi wewe unafuta ni bangi mbaya sana. Bangi nao kutoka 92 ile niliacha mpaka saa hii. Ufuti bangi. Kutoka 92 mpaka saa hii. This is from 19, 1992 he has he has never smoked bang. 98 February 9. 
Kwani ni mkubwa kwangu? He was born in 1980. February 9. Baba kwa katabara ba kwa. Oh. Eh. Hey. Like seriously? Hey. Family is seventy six. Is that you know Well, Philip. Well, guys. So. Um. We're done. We came to take the final report. Let everybody know that uh, yeah. Noah died. There's nothing we can do. We accept the will of God. Now, uh, Julius, I didn't even know his name is his name is Julius Angana. Born Noah. Noah Yanini Kwenda Wukati Noah. Sasa umeka noa ya nini? Si noa ilikuwa ya baba yako? Sasa ulijueke mbaka jina ya baba yako? So he has three names. Julius, Angana, Noah. And Noah was his father. So he even called himself his father's name. Uh, okay. Sawa sawa bas. Sasa sisi tunakutakia mema uko na nyumba. Tafuta mrembo. Uzae noa mwingine. You know, I, I, I don't know what's wrong with the world. Because the people you imagine cannot sleep at night because of the evil they, they do. You think they will not be sleeping at night. They seem to be sleeping, you know. I don't know how you can, you can sleep under your skin knowing the things you have done. Sometimes things bother me and I just can't do some things because... I will not be okay, especially at night. They will just come to me and haunt me. But maybe that is just me. Uh, and <sighs> just so sad. Yeah, so this is the lady who is neighbor to Noah. And she's staying with Asiko and Joyce, the sister. And guys, I was... I was trying to remember the the condition. It's called the Stockholm uh, syndrome. That's what Noah had. And when you have that uh, condition, then you will actually fall in love with your abductors, people who abuse you and and mess you up. You will protect them and not want anything to. So I think uh, that's what happened uh, between Noah and 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 his son, who was sexually abusing him physically abusing him you know torturing him and he would be taken to the police and then he goes and he says no my son is not guilty the police would want evidence he denies them the evidence until finally so we want to hear from the neighbor what really happened they have written on that paper malaria but i don't think it's malaria uh sequels uh foster mother will give us the the, the true report just right now Hey. Mm. So he he was actually cutting him like uh, all over his body, and the final cut that he did were on, on his back, and uh, and that was the final cut that apparently you know ended his life. Namuze alisema kwa nini ali ali yeye bado tu alikuwa na mtete. Mm. 
Okay. So he from the time he died, the, the son who is now Julius now, we know he is Julius. He goes to the grave and and and, and like does signs, maybe it's a prayer or maybe he's losing his mind. Uh, nobody knows, but he is doing that on the grave. And immediately he died, he sold off the materials from the house, um, the, the, the iron sheets, the timber and everything, like, you know, just sold everything. And then he sold even his, even his own house that he was staying in, he also sold the house. And then he, he ended the one that we built for his father, Noah. Hmm. Oh, said I will sell everything and get into this house that was built by this, this idiots. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> mm. So she kept on telling him, why can't you go to the senior residence? Those guys offered you a place. Why can't you go there? And he said, he would, he would say, no, 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 just, just leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm okay here. I'm okay here. Takuja next week to the letter uniform. Tuta, tuone uniform. Yeah. Nyo nyo ndiyo mulitupatia uniform wrong. 